I think peer reviewing these activities kind of raises the, the level of scholarship on them. I think it's a, it's a great experience. Um, it's a good learning experience, a good learning opportunity. I, I don't know if everybody always has the opportunity to express their opinions about something, and I think it's a, an outlet to do that. The reviews aren't nearly as hard to do as, say, like a research article or something. They don't take that long. Um, it keeps me current on kind of the, the latest um, things that are coming out that I could use in my own classes. When you look at things for review for Merlot, it's how might you use it? Typically in your classroom, you know, where would this, where would this fit? Um, and as a peer reviewer, you get um, a very formalized process with a, a, a specific things and goals and objectives and things that you're trying to evaluate and determine. And what I usually do is I go to the site and play around with it myself. I do it from different computers and different platforms. And then once I've gotten a feel for the site, I start the review process. And I usually do it in bits and pieces. I don't do it all at once. So you review it for content. You review it for um, accuracy and what type of site it is and what types of learning goals and objectives might um, be available. If there's any technical expertise that needs to be available or Say, for instance, if it requires a particular piece of software like Flash or Shockwave or something like that. We try to assign sites to uh, reviewers that are in their area of expertise, which would probably correlate with the classes that they teach. So it gives them an opportunity to kind of really sit down and um, look at some sites that they may not have looked at otherwise that, that they may be able to use in their own um, courses. I try to look for some um, new and different things every year, something that um, I haven't seen before, something that might be new. I look at uh, resources out there that in many instances are done better than if I would try to put something together on my own and just kind of piece it together. It has changed my teaching because it's given me so many things to choose from to use different types of activities that I never knew existed. And what's nice about it is that someone's reviewed it and recommended this material. I don't have to go out to Google and try to find something out of the blue that might be of quality. I usually go to Merlot first.